Hello, this is Nick from a ReviewOutlaw.com. Today I want to review kiteboarding in Key West. Um, so I went down to Key West, uh, this is winter time, um, and I wanted to learn how to kiteboard upwind. I was having a lot of trouble with that. I'm from Rhode Island, uh, so we don't get that many good days um, to kiteboard here. So I wanted to go somewhere where there are a lot more options, and Key West seemed to be the place. I ended up bringing my own kiteboard down. You can put it in a golf bag and you save a lot of money on uh, bringing it down if you put it in a golf bag. But I found a place called Upwind Kiteboarding and they're really nice. You can uh, check out their website. I'll put a link in the notes. But uh, Scott's the, the owner of that, that company. Great guy. Um, chat, texted with him a couple times just to make sure the weather was going to be good. And we settled on a date that the wind was going to be good. He's got a, a boat. What's great about him is for about $250 for one day, you get private one-on-one -on -one instructions. And that's where you'll see me and then the instructor, this is an instructor here, uh, doing the, the good jumps. Um, but he'll give you exactly, kind of hone in on what you need to improve on. And where they bring you out is a very flat area. There's no other boats, there's no other people to worry about. Uh, it's all soft sand. And you know, if you fall, you don't really get hurt. There's, if you mess the, the drop the kite, there's no rocks or anything like that to worry about. It's just a great safe area to learn. A very shallow. Um, it takes maybe about 30 minutes to get out there. Uh, the weather was great. Um, all, all the days we went, the wind was was perfect. Not too too much. And what's great is he has a lot of boards. He's got a lot of different kites. He's gonna uh, pump up the kite for you. So you just get to worry about learning. Um, going upwind is what I was having trouble with, and after I got that, I uh, progressed to kind of jumping, and I was having a little bit of trouble the first day, and I ended up going, um, we did uh, two days, and then a, a little half day session. So, the, but even when I say a day, I only uh, went for about four hours, because uh, you do get pretty exhausted um, kiteboarding, it, uh, especially four hours straight. But, uh, there, you know, basically, this is me kind of the beginning process getting up it was having a little bit of trouble kind of drifting downwind but as later the day progressed i was able to cut back the other direction and not have to actually stop and sink in the water that was another problem every time i turned i wasn't able to keep the progression going i would kind of sink in the water and then later on in the day i was able to uh, do jumps and things like that so kiteboarding is something that you want to try um, I definitely recommend you check out Upward Kiteboarding. You don't need any equipment. He's got everything, the wetsuits, the gear. Um, you just bring yourself, uh, you know, a water bottle, some suntan lotion, and you're good. Uh, there are people at all different skill levels, some people doing crazy jumps, things that I've never seen before. And then other people, I just, it was the first time they had never done it before. Age range, I mean, you can be anywhere from a lot of 60-year-olds, um, what we're doing at 70 year olds and uh, it was great to see that and then uh, also younger people as well so there's no really age restriction um, there's there's guys there's girls doing it it doesn't matter who you are a lot of times you think you have to be really strong to hold and control that kite it's not necessarily true you know if you're someone who's lighter weight they're gonna just use a lighter weight kite um, so that that's something to, to be aware of as well um, but if you guys have any questions for me let me know um, and, and I'll, I'll be happy to re reply in the comments. And if you just want to kind of keep watching the video, I have a couple other shots of us uh, kiteboarding out here. But it was great, great time. Really enjoyed um, my instructor and, and Scott and his whole team, very professional. Uh, felt very safe the whole time we were out there, which is great. And uh, the weather was awesome. So I can't wait to go back out there and uh, give it another try. All right. Thanks, guys.
guys. Thanks for watching my video. If you have time, please subscribe to my channel, click here to watch more videos, or please give me a thumbs up. Thanks.